hear the ministry of the sounds. So I thought it might be a good idea to make some sounds for the 2012 Church of the Lords. First and foremost, it's about the idea. We're not interested in whether or not Creative has a, the, the account. We're not interested in whether the ad is politically correct. Uh, we're not interested whether it complies with any sets of rules. What we're interested in is whether or not it's a great idea, pure and simple. It's not about the budget, it's not about the art direction, it's really about the insight, the actual idea. So that's that's what the chip chops are about. Winning the chip for the People's Choice Award goes to... Creative being for Hannibal Pringles. Uh, the idea I won for was uh, for a child obesity campaign. And it's basically fattening um, fast food brands like Haribo and KFC and um, you know flipping the idea around so that people that are eating these things are thinking you know the actual characters that are trying to advertise their you know foods and products and that are actually obese so really you know it's shit like you're eating basically well the chip shop awards you know it's exactly what it says on the tin it's limitless you can be as creative as possible a lot of the times you've got briefs and you, you're restrained by like the cost and uh, who it is that you're trying to pitch to or whatever, but literally you can just do anything that you want. Uh, you don't have to worry about brands fighting back at you saying, oh, you know, you, we can't show this or whatever. Like, yeah, you can just literally do what you want and be as free as you like. And Sachi and Sachi eggs for Diet Coke. Please come up with a picture of Because Diet Coke's all about staying thin, um, basically, we use the curvature of, of, the, of the Diet Coke can to, uh, to demonstrate that, like a thinning mirror. I think the, I personally think that the great thing with that campaign is that um, it's always been there on the can. The, the advertising has always been right there on the actual product and no one's ever bothered to put it out there as an advert. So they needn't spend too much money on it. Fairly inexpensive advert and it's a good piece of communication. Yeah. This business can get very frustrating. And, and, and the Chip Shop Award, just fantastic way to displaying your work. Sure, with and, a and giant's brand, a, a massive corporate brand like Coca-Cola or McDonald's or anything like that, it's very hard to get great work out there. And Chip Shop, Award, Chip Shop Awards, thankfully, gives a platform for us to do that, and I think it's fantastic. I really do. It is. Yeah. We have now come to the penultimate category of the evening, the Chairman's Awards. And this award goes to the ancient of the chairman of the judging panel, John Jessup from Leo Burnett, deemed his favourite. So please welcome John to say a few words. There's so much good stuff. It was a very, very hard decision this year. Since I've been judging it, and probably the last four years or whatever, this is the best year. This is the golden year. I thought there was so much good stuff. We really were torn to, you know, what to award and what not to award. High quality, good stuff. Yeah. I chose one because I thought it was beautifully simple and it, it just touched me, which was IKEA. First of all, I'm just I'm really shocked. I want to thank John Jessup for the award, and I want to thank the Chip Shop Awards for giving new creatives a platform to showcase the work. Thank you very much. The inspiration came from I was at, on a holiday in the Lake District, and we went into a little gift shop, and there was a top hat, and inside there was a plastic carrot and a plastic couple of pieces of coal. And I thought that would work great for a direct mail for I IKEA to send out a free sort of snowman. Some assembly required. I spent the majority of the holiday thinking how I could adapt that and make that into, into my, own, my own idea. So I came away, drew up a few ideas, and out came, and out came my inspiration. So I hope IKEA would like to use the advert. If you do, then give me a call. Um, and what I, would, I think creativity is all about people's personal opinion. So if you like it, I think you should use it. 2012 Grand Prix goes to Elvis Communications for TFL Considerate Food. Where did the inspiration come from? Well, really just from uh, living in London. And it's a, a sad fact that Londoners aren't the most compassionate people in the world. They're, they're in a hurry and when they're travelling, if they hear an announcement saying uh, there's a passenger action or someone has, uh, has a body on the line. Person under the train on a Friday night. Yeah, the first, first reaction isn't one of sympathy and that's really where it comes from. O-N-E.
G, as I think the young person say today. Thank you so much. Um, we thought we'd hit on a, a human truth, and um, I think that's what's at the heart of good ads. So uh, anyway, thank you very much. The bar's open. Thank you.